Hello folks, this is Ayat Tanaja from InspireToRise.com and today we are going to discuss the new Android Marshmallow update on the Lenovo Vibe P1 smartphone. So guys, let's begin. So let's discuss about what's changed. The user interface has definitely changed on Lenovo Vibe P1. As can be seen, the menu etc does feel a little bit different than before. On the on the themes which are already present on the Lenovo Vibe P1, as can be seen over here, the app drawer has definitely changed. On the top, we have all of those applications which are used the most and which are used the recent applications. So that's something nice about it. Overall smoothness of this phone has definitely improved and it does feel better than before even the standby time for the battery life has improved so that's also great about it after the update to Android 6.0.1 marshmallow on this one and apart from that few cosmetic minor UI changes have been done for example on the app screen here as can be seen while cleaning the tasks etc and you get RAM of around 1 gigabyte free on the 2 gigabyte and apart from that 37,173 was the score that we got from Antutu benchmark and as can be seen over here in detail the search bar has been merged with the recent applications and apart from that when you use the fingerprint unlock mechanism then you also get a pattern and this is what the notification drop down looks like right now and the toggles etc also look a little bit sharper and crisper than before camera performance has taken a major upgrade by this update after the update to android marshmallow 6.0.1 camera performance is definitely improved than before and as can be seen when the selfies are a little bit more vibrant more clearer than before earlier it was all muzzy heady but now it's not the case and now even pictures of far distant skylines with buildings in the distant shots are visible in clear detail so that's something which has been improved on the vibe p1 and lenovo has made sure that they fulfilled their promise of giving marshmallow update for this device and apart from that overall performance has definitely improved and we also tried few other things we tried to install the google now launcher on this device to see how close could we get to the stock android feel and google now on tap also works nice on this one after the marshmallow update and there was no problem while searching for contextual information while using this smartphone and this is what the phone looks like after installing the google now launcher and using a different theme from the lenovo themes you can just change the icons via leno you can change your icons via using the different themes from the Lenovo theme store so that's good and overall this smartphone has become worthy of its price tag the battery life was already phenomenal around 5000 mAh battery was present and it has improved even further after the software updates so guys this was it for this short quick video in case you liked it don't forget to hit the thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to our channel this is Ayat Tanansha from InspireToRise.com signing off folks stay inspired to rise